linda. Tell me something I don't know. Yeah. Carola. I don't wanna know where you are. Are you singing? Are you Nina? <laughs> are you the OGC <laughs> Nina now? <laughs> Uh, yes. <laughs> my name is Mandy Gonzalez, and I am here at the Crest Theater. It's my first stop on my Fearless tour. I'm taking the week off from Hamilton, and I'm hitting seven different cities in uh, seven days. <laughs> so this is my first stop, so I'm thrilled to be here. And when I found out that the Crest Theater was very close to the Parkland shootings, I made sure to reach out to a couple of the students to see what I could do while I was here, if there's any any help that they that they needed and one of those students was was Cameron and he and Brendan Duff said that they wanted to sing so I said I, I can do that my son. That was my son. My first night here at the Crest was really, um, any night doing my show Fearless is a night of celebration. It's a night of healing. It's a night of joy because it's such a personal show to me. But last night was really one of the top nights on stage I've ever had. And it's because it gave me so much hope for our future by looking at these kids and the fact that they were able to be so vulnerable on stage and sing a song that they just learned maybe two weeks ago was a beautiful thing because you could see their vulnerability but also the fact that they are resilient and I think that I've been watching that on the news but to see it up close was pretty inspiring. I feel blessed to be, have been able to share that with uh, the Crest Theater. What you want to say and let the words fall out. Honestly, I want to see you be brave. What you want to say, that's right. Let the words fall out. Honestly, I want to see you be brave. When I first started singing as a kid, I always would say, well, they said, what do you want to do? And I said, well, I want to change the world. And it was never about anything but that. And being able to connect with the students yesterday is part of how I help the change happen, by showing them my support and by giving them strength. And uh, they do the same for me. So uh, I was happy to give back. And the audience you know, was on their feet about four times through the night. And so I think that's the beautiful thing about theater is that it's a community. You know, it's one thing doesn't happen just, a show doesn't happen just because of the person in the spotlight. A show happens because of a stage manager, lighting crew, sound, the band, the audience. And so I think that to be able to share that that sense of community and to show the kids that they have a whole community behind them was so, so beautiful. Can you please real quick say, I'm Gonzalez, I'm beautiful. I have to go. No. <laughs> I'm Andy Gonzalez, I'm beautiful. Tell me something I don't know. A lot of theater kids, a lot of kids in the arts are told a lot of times when I do master classes, well, my parents don't think I should do this because I won't make money. I won't make a living. And there's risk for that in anything you do. But also, training in the arts of any kind gives you so much as a human being. You know, the fact that I trained in theater allows me to do public speaking. It allows, you know, people, uh, young students that I've worked with have gone on to become lawyers, doctors, people that are like the kids um, from Stoneman Douglas. I mean, they're kids that are not afraid to get up and speak in front of an audience. And I think theater training definitely has uh, an impact in that, you know, as well as can you think outside of the box? 
we're looking for something new we don't want what we had before somebody that is an artist or somebody that is a painter can think outside the box because they're already used to doing that and to give them encouragement is so important to our community the arts have to be a part of the community arts education has to be important because it helps the community you can't just have all of the same kind of people in a community you have to have people that think outside the box to make everything better Awesome. <laughs> it's so beautiful that, you know, I'm here at the Crest and it's sold out for two nights. And that's a testament to this community and to the people that run the theater that this is a respected, um, this is a respected theater. And theater is so important for our community because it's a place where we can come together and share an experience with this theater, with my friend Nelva, and with the students because there's nothing like community and we have to stand together. To see your show live, amazing. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Now I can just listen to the album too. <laughs> That's what I say. The album is available. <laughs> Fearless. It is. Fearless. Okay. Thank you so much. Good night. This man, it's Gonzalez. I'm like, I'm speechless. I'm like, totally like, she's amazing. She's amazing. March 24th! March 24th! March 24th! And also, if you're a young person, please register to vote. Voting is so important. It's so much more important than everything else. Everything else in life. Yay!